that's a bit puzzling to learn that 50 million people work on crossword puzzles every week. On this National Puzzle Day, Jake Peterson visits a man around town who is king of the crossword. Clue, a Tampa man who is widely known for his crosswords. Answer, Merle Regal. I thought I invented them when I was six years old. Uh, I was a big fan of uh, Kenner Girder builder sets and Tinker Toys. When I found out what words were, I just did the exact same thing. I just built these little structures out of them. And he's been constructing crosswords ever since, even getting published in papers like the Los Angeles Times and the Washington Post. I will find these little interesting things, factoids, and put them in puzzles. Merle just sees words differently, like my name, for example. Jake Peterson scrambles up and to present a joke. You've got joker in your name, you've got jerk in your name, you got jester, there's all kinds of things. He constructs the puzzles by starting with a blank chart, shading out one-sixth of the blocks, and then putting in the words. The clues come later. People all around the world are challenged by his brain busters. I always say crosswords are like a thigh master for your mind. Merle was featured in the 2006 documentary Wordplay. It's all about the crossword culture. Even John Stewart and President Bill Clinton are in the movie. Sometimes you have to go at a problem the way I go at a complicated crossword puzzle. Let's have our own fun with words by answering Merle's questions. All the answers end with the word list. Here's your first question. A salon person who does your hair. Stylist. Right. Someone who rides a two-wheeler as in the Tour de France. Uh, bicyclist. Good. To sign up for as the Army. Enlist. Right. A stirring preacher such as Billy Graham. Uh, evangelist. Right. Whew. I hope none of that left you puzzled. You can try your hand at Merle's Puzzles. Look for the links on our website, thelistshow.tv. For The List, I'm Jake Peterson.